male candidate here uh, who's going to be set up on the date with the beautiful Christine. And uh, yeah, we're just going to basically do the same dynamic, you know, ask some some prompts and. And we'll see if uh, this is the one. We'll see. We'll see. So, guys, uh, welcome. We'll welcome our, our third candidate. And can you just uh, introduce yourself and name, age, and, and what you do? My name is Moses. Um, I am actually a audio engineer at a small local radio station in downtown Miami. Excellent. And, and oh, yeah, yeah that's How right. You? you don't know. I'm, 30, I'm actually 34 years old. 34. Mm-hmm. I just turned 34 last Friday. So Happy birthday! Yeah, birthday. Let's Thank go! You. There you go. Thank you. Thank so you. is that Taurus? No. <laughs> Gemini. Gemini. Okay. May 31st. <laughs> yeah. Is Gemini oh, May 31st, a, a bad sign for you? Actually, it probably is. Gemini is yeah, it's amazing. definitely not compatible. No. Oh, it's amazing for you? No. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Big boys, Mo. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Moses. Go. Oh. Okay. So first like question that. is, at your current age, what do you see wrong with dating for men and women? Mm. We'll start with the lovely South Africa. Christine. <laughs> yes. Christine. Go At my age. Oh, well, I would say there's a lot of expectation of, of, you know, wanting to start a family or like men thinking that I want to start a family immediately. And so it's almost like a little bit, of an uncomfortable situation it's like i'm not you know just because i'm 33 doesn't mean i just want to have a baby right now um Mm. so there's there's that that i feel like i want to get past you know is this an eastern european accent i'm hearing south african south african yeah ah (laughs) yeah south african one could be tricky yeah yeah that is a little okay yeah i mean time is is of the essence though oh sorry go ahead mo what (laughs) do you think Mm. Yeah. I don't really have that much of a problem with the dating world today. Um, I'm always a big believer that everyone has their standards. They have their, uh, they have their preferences, and you know, whatever preferences they have, I don't think everyone should be blamed for that. Everyone has their wants and needs, and I mm. think everyone's allowed to have their wants and needs. And I just look at myself to make sure, like, hey, am I the guy that am I the guy that they want? Am I the guy that they need? If not, well, I mean. There's more people in the world. Yeah. But in your opinion, though, uh, Moses, why do you think that most people are complaining about the dating landscape, you know, here in Miami? I do believe that there's a lot of lack of communication between the two parties, mm-hmm. uh, between the men and the woman. And, uh, you know, there's times guys want one thing, but I don't know if they're expressing it um, as honestly as they should be. Mm. How do you feel about that, Christine, that men aren't expressing themselves the way that they want to be understood? As honestly as they should mm, be. Oh, as honestly, yeah. yeah. Well, I, I do feel like Miami is probably the hardest place that I've been for dating, just because I think, you know, there's this whole show that everybody's kind of, you know, all dressed up and it's about money and being beautiful and sexy and so i think to get past that and to really communicate with each other yeah i think that that's to meet someone who really does want to be vulnerable and be authentic and and share what they really want i think that is unique here for sure okay uh would you describe yourself as sexual and how Who's first? And how? <laughs> how? <laughs> Tell Let's me get, details. <laughs> Let's get deep here. So you're already, assu- you're already assuming that I'm saying yes. I can't. I can't be a saint and an upstanding individual in this humane society. Or well, something? just so you know, he donates to the church. Uh, exactly. 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 Thank you. Know. Thank. <laughs> but on Saturdays, what do you do? What do, you do? <laughs> uh, um, on Saturdays, I like to donate to the community. You know, just give back to the community when I'm donating. So, um, donate to the church. I love that. <laughs> Um, I mean, we, I mean, we're all human beings. We have needs. We have wants, you know, we have likes, you know, we see something we like and, um, you know, especially if that person's our type, you know, we're going to, of course, we're going to have our needs. We're going to want it. So, and, you know, I don't blame anyone for that. And I'm like that. And I think everyone's like that. What about, How about you? you, Christine? <laughs> uh, I'm definitely sexual, but I don't you know i wait until i really believe that someone's very interested in me and that they you know that we're really like each other and that there's a deeper connection 
I I wouldn't enjoy sex if that wasn't there. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, I think that's yeah, the connection is super important to me before sexuality. The connection, but, yeah, but when that's there, yeah, definitely very sexual. <laughs> and so, 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 sorry, Moses, you, you kind of danced around the subject though. So you'd say you are yes. A very sexual person. Um, not just that I am. It's just I, I believe everyone is, oh, especially okay. some, especially uh, someone from South Africa where they love dance with their hips and shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know definitely. Even she is as as of course the connection is needed, but and even I know even South Africa too. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> okay okay good yeah uh, he's, and, he's uh, gonna smile i love this i love this yes there you go <laughs> hey um real quick uh one more question guys i'm curious because yeah people are like oh men are like this we're like that but what for you would if you were on a date um would be the biggest turnoff for the opposite sex to do oh if you're like oh man there's definitely not a second date or i'm even like leaving <laughs> yeah hmm. you first yeah <laughs> no you first <laughs> no yeah, you definitely you already I already know you already got something too. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you don't, do even, want, you don't do even want to tell us because you don't want to seem like an asshole, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> well <Yep>. <laughs> I can say something that has happened to me on a date oh. was <laughs> a guy actually invited me to go to a strip club after the date. So <laughs> you what? He, no. he did what? What? <laughs> he invited me to after the date go with him and hang out at a strip club. Wow. Did you go? No. <laughs> <laughs> so you're like, we're done. We're done. Good night. That was it. I would have walked right out too. I don't. Know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, that was that was a pretty bad one. No, I don't yeah. do strip clubs on any dates. Okay, First, second, great. third, twenty fifth. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been me. <laughs> Keeping it being, that would have been me. Anyhow, uh, Moses, what about you? Yeah. Um. Like the biggest, like the biggest turn off on the date, yeah. Or like first date. Mm. <sighs> mm. Especially I don't ask. Especially I don't really ask for much. All right. Just, just I, I'll okay, say there has to be something. Yeah, of course there's definitely yeah. something. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> um. Say it. As, as long as you're not bald, that's that's one of my biggest. <laughs> you better not be bald. He's dancing around. You better not. <laughs> that's not even dancing. You better not be bald. That's so it's a last thing. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, that's too funny. Um, but I, you know, but I, but I do want honesty. That's the mm. that's one of the biggest things. So okay. if you're actually if you um, portray yourself as someone and then you come up to me and I see a completely different person, mm. I'm like, I, this is not the person that I courted. This is not the person that. I was like, mm-hmm. I was messaging, like, who are you? I don't mm-hmm. even know who you are. It feels like an actual blind date. Mm. No, no lies, no lies, no yeah. boy, no, no boy, no. All right, guys. So, what is it gonna be? The drum roll for thumbs up for a second date or thumbs down? Thumbs down. <laughs> so, thumbs up first. Okay, we got her mm. answer. Time for yours, brother. That was easy. She seems cool. I like. I like. That. Okay. 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 Right. So in Marco, Marco. three, two, one, blindfolds off. Take it off. Take it off. Take it off. Hey. 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 I like it. I like it. Hey man, she said she wanted deeper, bro. You definitely South African. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Do you keep your same answer from before? Yes. Okay. Yes. Whoa. Okay. I and keep the same answer. She's pretty good. We'll do, we'll do the part two. Yeah, I'm not sure what here. Oh, After this, we'll be to come back. Yep. And uh, good job. Good, good job. job, guys. Good Thank job. you. All right. <laughs> that was great. That was cute. That was cute. They're both very cute. Very yes. cute. Um, yeah. yeah. What did you think? I think um, for the first time, the first interaction with her and the first guy was cool. But I think he made her laugh, one. And two, he was very, I want to say, soothing, but yet at the same time, charismatic. Yeah, he has such a calming presence about yeah. him, even though she can't see him. Yeah. Like, I think it's his voice. Uh, you know? I think he has a cheat code. His voice is, is a game winner here because... It, it helps. It helps. He has a radio voice. Yeah. No pun intended here, but you, yeah. know, you know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> no, but it really does. Like, a woman can feel this sense of security by just a man's voice. I know it sounds silly. It's not everything. 
but it helps. And also, age shouldn't really be that much of a factor sometimes, but because he was definitely around our age group and older, mm -hmm. it made it a little bit more palatable. 100% you know, more receptive. That. I agree. Yeah, yeah. I agree. But automatically, when they start up and they hear the age difference, automatically it's a check minus. Yeah. And so we're human. Even you know? though people can actually be older and still immature. Uh, vice versa it mm -hmm. just depends on the person actually the individual yeah i would say because of his age and his smooth talk he went over i mean yeah we had last week the couple you know there was i think at least a 12 year age difference yeah. more or less uh remember what i'm talking about yeah, yeah crystal and i forget the name of the guy but they hit it off they totally hit it off. that was probably like our best couple last week yo I, I i'm not gonna lie this thing of moses knows every country every culture He's and very comes culture. into the game with knowledge and a mm. smile you can't beat that and <laughs> Moses, let me ask you, mm. is a relationship on your vision board right now? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you feeling ready to yeah. for a long-term relationship? Yeah. I've always been a relationship guy. Anyways. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Great. And maybe that's something that we can talk about on the next date. But uh, you've been thinking about that? Yeah. I feel like I Moses was born for this, though. Born for the spotlight. What? Huh? He He's definitely got a skill. Yeah, I'm he, not, does. yeah. he does. He does. Yay, we're back at our date. Okay, so this is gonna be the last segment here. And, and don't worry, no, I don't. There's no OnlyFans going on, so. Okay, first date. <laughs> Second here. Time, location, setting, and we'll act it out right here. Let's go. Definitely, like maybe around seven o'clock. Okay. Seven. <laughs> I know you're gonna have plenty of time to put on your makeup or <laughs> probably don't even need that much of it anyway. Thank you. <laughs> um, Still thoughtful though. I'm I'm gonna take probably one of my favorite Haitian restaurants. Oh, I see. Yeah. Especially South African. You actually love those type of food anyway. You would love those type of food. Very similar. Uh, You've never had Haitian food before? There's one. Or you're vegan. Vegetarian? Vegan. So? <laughs> <laughs> I like the the Good answer. <laughs> Meat is not the only thing we eat. Perfect. <laughs> so, wait, hold on. What else? What, what else? On, like, like what, what? What else do you need to know? Like, like what other? <laughs> like, what's not? What's not on the menu? Like, like is rice not a th not okay? No, that's, that's not. not that's yeah. Not meat, nope. <laughs> but is it okay? That's yes, what I'm wondering. Yeah, no, okay. I, I eat everything else. Everything else, yeah. just not meat. Yeah. Okay, okay. So yeah. that me oh, that's easy. That, there's there's more than plenty of alternatives. There's like you know, of course, rice. There's beans. I, I know it. you love beans or love or it. like beans alternatives. <laughs> uh, sweet plantains is sweet, savory. Yeah, there's. So You've we're gonna go to a one. vegan before, haven't you? Uh, yeah, yep, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Most been around the world. Yeah, I've I've had a few friends before. That's all. So okay. you know, I you know I I know a few people just here and there. So okay. that's why. Um, yeah. So Haitian restaurant, seven o'clock. Sounds fun. You're, I'm, I'm picking you up. I like. That. Yeah, you don't you don't have to drive nowhere. Now. Don't worry, it's, that's fine. Okay, so let's put the setting when you're mm -hmm. in the restaurant, on the date, that conversation right now. Let's go. And I know you're gonna be enjoying the music too. Yeah, yeah, like that kind of like that similar that island feel. I love it. I love it. What do you like to do? What do you uh, do? For? I well, I love water sports and I <laughs> love going to the beach. <laughs> yeah. What about you? Mm, I I actually do enjoy beaches. I do enjoy yeah? like the the calmness, it, the way it like eases your mind. You like to swim? Yeah, actually, I'm actually good at swimming. Uh, kind of. I'm all right. I'm all right at swimming. All right. But uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what kind of beaches have you been to? What's your What was one of your favorite beaches? Uh, well, I love to go to Aleta State Park. I don't know if you've ever Where's been. That? It's in Miami. It's like uh, it's in the Bay Area, mm. and it's just white beach, and it's very quiet and calm. Mm. If you go during the week, there's no one else there. So That's actually the best time to go. Yeah, I'm you'd sure. like that. Yeah, that is that is one of the best. And no one leaving you alone. No, no, <laughs> no naked man. No old naked man. All hairy, <laughs> all up in your face. None of, none of that. <laughs> <laughs> Drunk as hell. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, please leave me alone. Like, <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> what do you enjoy doing? Um, besides beaches, you know, I, I, you know, I work on like a, you know, besides when I'm working at the radio station. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, I like to enjoy time with friends. You know, I like I like a, anything that's calm, relaxing, anything that's like where I can just, you know, just be with myself and my mind. That's what I like to do. Mm-hmm. Um, I do love dancing. Ooh. I enjoy music. I, I enjoy lots that. of music. What I, kind of dancing? Anything that makes me dance my shoulders and hips, I love it. That's that's the type of dancing that. Have you, you done know. salsa dancing? I actually have. Yep. Really? Yeah. Okay, I like that. We can, can you, do that. Can you do salsa? Yeah, I love yeah. salsa dancing. On one, and our t- on one and our, on two. Uh, on one. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> okay. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so imagine, I, imagine I'm your host. I play some nice salsa music, mm. and you guys get up and do salsa. Oh. And Thank I'm you. playing Mo's music, Mo's song. Okay. I don't have. I don't have do I have songwriter? <laughs> I mean, let's right do here, it. right now. Let's right now, go. let's do it. Do you actually? Yeah. You know what? <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes, love it. Oh yeah! Let's go! Let's go! No. Where's the salsa oh. music? We need some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, big low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kill it! Yes, yeah. oh. Okay, bro. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's done. It's done. You. Oh. Oh. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Winning her over. Yo, Milken dance. Oh, okay, oh, okay, oh, 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 you don't know this, but he is. No, I'm, I'm world renowned, international what? artist. <laughs> All right, sing me a song. Woo. Okay. okay. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, sir. Get in the tone. Y estoy aquí salva tu día te mereces mejor. No más llorando si eras mía te mereces mejor. Serás más segura conmigo, te prometo. Te mereces mejor. Te mereces mejor. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was beautiful. Wow. Y'all are messed up, but y'all are unfair. <laughs> That's amazing. That's beautiful. Thank you. I'm glad you like I've it. never been serenaded like that before. <laughs> wow. Okay. I'm feeling the yeah. 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 the man. Moses. Party mm. the Red Sea. Wink, wink. Um, okay. What? Okay. <laughs> this is uh, this is this is the best. This is one of the best. Yeah. So <laughs> that is time. That is time. This is good. And uh, before we close this out here, how was the date for you, Kristen? I loved it. I had a great time. Mo, sis, I enjoyed it. Okay, she was actually, and you was actually honest too. So I like that. So, yeah. You're no lying here. Yeah, she wasn't lying. <laughs> okay, and last question. And this is all said and done. Would you? Go on a real date outside of here. Yes, and close sir. your eyes and give your thumbs up or thumbs down. Yeah. Thumbs up or thumbs down. Wow! Oh! And that, ladies and gentlemen, oh! is a fresh man. Oh! Let's go! Oh! Good job. Good job. Oh! There you go. Good job with that. Good job with that. Good job. Oh! Good job. Oh! Okay. Good job. So we'll close it up there. Uh, thank you, Mo. Thank you, Christine. And, uh, Yo, real talk. That was great. <sighs> okay. So first and foremost, you know, uh, I felt the 100% of them just their authenticity. He was making her laugh. She, yeah. she had such a cute little flirty laugh, yeah. you know, but also felt real. She's not trying to turn around with her, her laugh. And also, hello, the dancing. Like, You know what I realized about these episodes here? When the girl laughs... It's almost like a magic trigger, like, okay, Foot he's not boring, entertaining, mm-hmm. and I'm actually, like, having fun. Yes. And, and girls just want to have fun. I mean, the first date should be only about fun. Ain't nothing too serious, Not too serious, you know? lighthearted, yes. funny, relaxing, enjoyable. And I think Mo did that very well. Yes. And also, the walls come down, you know? But also, it sends a sign to the man. And if and the men who are watching don't know this, once she starts laughing, that's your foot in the door. And like, also, okay. what you should do is learn how to dance. Because if you can dance with a woman, especially on a first date, salsa, merengue, bachata, mm-hmm. and even, you know, Just a, Caribbean even dancing, you like whining. That. You're gonna make away her heart. That's not possible for most people because you dance. You dance with her. 
you connect with her, you're touching her body is like body language. 100%. And he sang to her too. I mean, most niggas can't sing though, so don't, don't sing at home. Uh, <laughs> but if you can he dance. knocked it out of the park. I'll tell you, when I first came to America, I went to salsa classes. Oh, yeah. I learned in literally uh, three weeks how to dance salsa. It took a little longer because I don't know what the one to three. When I learned it, guess where I went? To a lounge and I did salsa with a girl. Instantly, it was a connection because, oh, you can dance, you're black. Mm -hmm. It was like an ultimate, like, wow, I'm shocked. Check and plus plus. having something like that in your arsenal on a date is impressive. So yeah. make, her, make her laugh, have a good time, answer questions. If you can dance, even better. Yeah. If you can sing, as Mo just showed you guys, it's a, a W. So Yeah, you knocked it out of the park. Yeah. And even if you can't dance, lie. I'm not a big, big proponent of lying, but just say because then you can learn like because no woman wants to hear on the first date oh so he's never gonna dance with me they don't want to hear that because could you imagine a woman go to a club all the time they meet guys whenever they go out and the guy just sit, stands there looking cool like this but if you can actually dance and you enjoy dancing and she's like your partner just for you to dance with i'm telling you mm -hmm. like it's like a key to unlock a door that's really shut and most guys can't open out that door but if you can mm -hmm. you win mm -hmm. um but yeah, I think this was a fresh match, yeah. uh, Mo and Christine. And honestly speaking, like this is why we do this, guys, because I love people coming together. You love it too. Love it. And it's more like if you can see it in real time, hopefully it inspires you to do more for yourself and your family. I think for most people here, you're scared because you're nervous that you're gonna look crazy, you're gonna look, um, you know, not interesting, you're gonna look like like sad, or whatever. Mm -hmm. I get it. We're all men here, but as you guys can see, three guys came up here, showed you it's possible, and even though they might not have gotten the date. You know what they got? Confidence. Yeah. So the more you do it, the more you go out, the more you talk to girls, the more you go on dates, the better you should become if you're taking notes for yourself and learning from that. Repetition. Absolutely. Absolutely. No, it's like all of this is. And guys, steal. I mean, these guys, steal their confidence. You don't got confidence at home? Steal theirs. Like, borrow someone else's. I'm serious. And go out there. And, and guys. You gotta fake it till you make it. If I can do it, if Mo can do it, why <sighs> can't you do it? Mm-hmm. There agree. you go. I all agree. right. This was a great show. Yes. Three